I'm Jenny from Needlepoint.com. For me, there's nothing better than starting a brand new canvas. It's like Christmas morning, only better. But before you just jump into that process, it's good to think through how you're going to approach the canvas. On a canvas like this, with a large area of white, I'd make sure I stitched in all the white first. This is because you don't want to accidentally pull in little bits of green or blue into that white. You really want to keep it looking crisp. After that, I'd go back and I'd fill in all this yellow, and then I'd have fun adding detail after. On a simpler canvas like this, where it's only made up of two color areas, I would want to add a decorative stitch to the background to add interest to the design. To do that, you'll want to make sure that you stitch in the background first, so that it's easy to compensate through these little fiddly bits of pineapple. After that, you can go back in and add that metallic thread. On a small ornament like this, I would stitch the reindeer last. This is because you'd want to do him in a fun, fuzzy thread. You don't want to pull any of that thread through to other areas on your canvas. For more tips and tricks, visit our website, needlepoint.com.